Hey everyone, Alicia here. Welcome to Conversational Phrases. We've found that the best way to learn a language is to speak it from day one. And the best way to start speaking is to learn phrases that you'll use in real conversations. In this lesson, we'll learn conversational phrases to answer the question, what's the matter? After watching this video, you'll be able to make complaints and ask someone else if they're having any issues. And if you want to learn more vocabulary, phrases, and example sentences you can use in real life situations, click the link in the description to download your Making Complaints PDF cheat sheet for free. Now let's take a look at some conversational phrases. Listen to the dialogue. È tutto a posto? L'ufficio è caldo. Once more with the English translation. È tutto a posto? What's the matter? L'ufficio è caldo. The office is hot. First of all, you'll need to learn how to say, What's the matter? That's... È tutto a posto? Listen to it again. È tutto a posto? È tutto a posto? This Italian sentence literally translates into, Is it everything in the right place? But it means, What's the matter in English? Now, how do you answer this question? The pattern is, L'ufficio è adjective, The office is adjective. For example, the office is hot. L'ufficio è caldo. L'ufficio è caldo. Here are a few more examples you can use with the same pattern to make complaints. Hot. Caldo. Caldo. Cold. Freddo. Freddo. Noisy. Rumoroso. Rumoroso. Dirty. Sporco. Sporco. Let's look at some examples. Listen and repeat or speak along with the native speakers. È tutto a posto? L'ufficio è freddo. È tutto a posto? L'ufficio è rumoroso. È tutto a posto? L'ufficio è sporco. Okay, now it's your turn. Do you remember how to say, what's the matter? È tutto a posto? Imagine the office is cold. Do you remember how to say cold? Freddo. Freddo. Say, the office is cold. L'ufficio è freddo. Now answer the question saying the office is cold. È tutto a posto? L'ufficio è freddo. Now imagine the office is noisy. Do you remember how to say noisy? Rumoroso. Rumoroso. Say, the office is noisy. L'ufficio è rumoroso. Now, answer the question saying the office is noisy. È tutto a posto? L'ufficio è rumoroso. Now imagine the office is dirty. Do you remember how to say dirty? Sporco. Sporco. Say, the office is dirty.
L'ufficio è sporco. Now answer the question, saying the office is dirty. È tutto a posto? L'ufficio è sporco. In this lesson, you learned new vocabulary and phrases you can use in your everyday life to make complaints. You are now able to share your concerns like a native speaker. Start by practicing in the comments below. Make any complaints you may have today. Lastly, don't forget to click the link in the description and download your PDF cheat sheets. You'll get useful phrases you need for everyday life for free. See you in the next lesson. Bye.